Hey, John Cristani here, online entrepreneur and digital marketer. And in this video, I'm gonna be talking about digital marketing, how to get into it, okay? So I'll be going over, I've been doing digital marketing for the last 10 years. I run my own business, which makes about $7 million a year. And digital marketing is a great place to be. The average salaries range from 40 to 88 thousand dollars per year in digital marketing and in this lesson I'm gonna be going over how you can learn the basics the different ways you can learn the basics I'll also be going over how to get an advantage in digital marketing I'll be discussing with you how to get ahead of the curve what are some forefront areas that you can become an expert in and be an especially valuable person or an employee and I'll show you how to start gaining experience and then I'll go over some pro tips at the end of the video so that hopefully you'll be able to come away with this video with not only an understanding of what digital marketing is, but also how to make money with it. So watch and learn. Hey, John Cristani, and I just love marketing, okay? I love marketing, and I've been doing it for 10 years because I find it so fascinating. I, You know, growing up, I was always a wizard or a sorcerer in the video games I played, and I believe marketing is actually the power of magic. It's the ability to say a few words and affect thousands of people or millions of people all across the globe, and going into digital marketing gives you that the ability to do that for a job, right? It's not even work at that point. For many of you, you're probably going into digital marketing because you think it's cool or whatever it is, but what does digital marketing actually mean? Now, digital marketing usually refers to a job in a large company that has enough departments, that has a big enough marketing department to have separated out digital marketing from other marketing efforts. You know, maybe it's sales support marketing, or basically if, if a company is big enough to have digital marketing positions, it means it's a pretty big company. And usually you're working for a big corporation and doing all right. And that's how I started. I started out in a company of about 100 people. I was actually a PPC analyst. So I was managing, that sounds kind of weird, PP analyst, right? No, it's PPC analyst, meaning I was a pay-per-click analyst and I was analyzing and doing people's Google advertising for them. So first, to get started in digital marketing, you need to learn the basics, all right? So what are the basics? So learn the basic knowledge, get in groups, and learn from courses. Now, first off, knowledge. Now, Google and Facebook have free courses. Okay, which explains all of the terminology, all of the stuff you need to know. But you could also learn digital marketing just by listening to YouTube channels like this one. Every video I do is related to marketing. So you can learn a lot of marketing from people like me. And obviously I'm a business owner making a few million dollars a year. So I have some experience in this place, but you can also learn from the companies themselves, which one thing to keep in mind is that if you wanna be an entrepreneur, I'd say generally speaking, it's best to learn from entrepreneurs. If you want to be an employee, might be, you know, it's just as good to learn from employees because that's the position you're looking to be in. And it's employees teaching these, but they're not going to teach the real cutting edge marketing techniques that allows you to start your own business. So just keep that in mind when going through the Google and Facebook courses. I also suggest groups, okay? So groups, I think are a great way to learn. A lot of people process knowledge in groups. Now there seems to be a tendency, I forget there's a study done somewhere, but basically men learn better solo, whereas women learn better in groups. Both men and women need to learn solo and in groups to really get the most knowledge and to really have it sink in the most possible. And that's why we've created a few groups here. There are links in the description for you to join our Discord community, which is a way you can chat. We have a subreddit, which is a forum, which allows you to post articles and ask questions and get feedback. We also have a Facebook group where you can post in and interact with other members. So I think all of those are great options. I think Discord is actually the best community to join, if you ask my opinion. I even drop into the Discord sometimes as well. Now, courses, I also suggest you go through some online courses if you're looking to get into digital marketing. I don't really suggest school. I don't really suggest college or community college. If you're looking really just to be a high paid employee, go, you know, 
colleges can work out fine. The education system is really meant to train people to be employees, so that would be a great place to be. I obviously, you can hear, I advocate people be entrepreneurs, and that just affords you more time, more freedom, more control, more money, more everything. So if you're looking to go the crazy route, right, the unsafe route, which I actually believe is a safer route, you know, take non-college courses. Take courses from people who are all, who are very successful online. What I've seen about college is that a lot of college professors, you know, they're boring and they're old and they haven't done whatever their profession is they're teaching about in many years. And they're just, why would you want to listen to somebody who's old and boring when you could actually learn from somebody who's in the cut doing it? I'm making $500,000 a month doing my business right now and I take time out of my day to teach people so you can learn from somebody who's in the cut, in the weeds, in the trenches, doing live. And you could take my course, which is the Super Affiliate System, right? You know, obviously, I'm I'm biased here, but Super Affiliate System, very successful course. Tens of thousands of students have gone through it. A couple number of people have become millionaires from the knowledge they learned and applied in it. So I would suggest you take that. And if you wanna learn more about it, there's a free training which explains what the Super Affiliate System is. The link is in the description. Now next, I would suggest you get an advantage, okay? You need an advantage. If you're going into digital marketing, the job market is very hard. The job market's getting smaller as bigger businesses move to more things like the Uber model or Amazon Flex or Postmates or DoorDash. Really, corporations are stratifying, so you, it's more competitive to get, there's fewer jobs, but and it's more competitive to get them, and the rest of positions are sort of contractor-based which are a little less stable. So to get an advantage, to give yourself the best advantage possible to get a job is start learning how to do more things. Image and video editing is so important. And if you can combine just knowledge of digital marketing with image or video editing, that's that's a good place to start. First off, I, I'd almost call it not an advantage. I think anybody, need, to get a job nowadays, it's almost necessary to have an advantage. Learn image editing. You can learn it for free. Learn video editing. You can learn it for free online. These are great things to do, great assets to a company. Most companies have their own separate departments for editing vi images, editing videos. So if you can come into a company and say, I can do both of these. I can do that. I can do digital marketing and I can edit my own ads and images and videos. That'll be huge and that'll make you a double threat. I guess. To make yourself a triple threat, which is what I believe is the ultimate in marketing, is you learn website design. And once again, you can learn this for free. There's no reason you should not learn it. Spend your time learning these skills. You know, I, I put out a lot of videos on how to do marketing, but a lot of people don't even learn the basics first. I almost consider these basics. Learn image editing, learn video editing, learn website design, get yourself an advantage. Won't go further on that, just spend the time. Take a week for each of those to learn it. Now. Now, if you really want to get ahead of the curve, I'm going to go over three different ways that you can give yourself a monster advantage over any other candidate if you're looking for a digital marketing job or just if you're looking to do it as an entrepreneur. These are three new emerging areas which will make you just a super valuable human being. Number one is marketing automation. Now, a lot of the traffic methods I teach on my channel are using social media such as Facebook, Google, YouTube, LinkedIn, etc., to post, to put up posts and to get free traffic from those websites. It's great, right? There's billions of people using Facebook and you can literally just type in a post for free, right? You're getting free traffic. In order to fully utilize those platforms and just make it really efficient, if you bundle in automation to software programs and other scripts, you can actually get that done way faster. You could message a thousand people a second with automation, whereas manually you can only message one person a second. With automation, you could post on 20 different social platforms in a second, whereas as if you were to do that manually, it might take you some time. So learning automation and automation scripting and stuff like that is very powerful. Another major advantage you can give yourself is learning paid advertising. Now, a lot of companies pay a lot of money for paid advertising and many digital marketing jobs involve doing paid advertising. You can learn a little bit about paid advertising on my channel. You can check out my videos. I think there's turn $50 into $500 a day using Google ads. I have some videos on Facebook advertising beginner to expert in Facebook advertising. There should be some bubbles around here. My Facebook advertising video is pretty long, so you're gonna have to be able to sit down for like 45 minutes to watch it, but it goes over everything you need to know about Facebook advertising. You'll be an expert by the end of that. And 
There are free courses where you can learn paid advertising as well. But I would suggest if you really want to get an advantage and really if you want to work for yourself, if you want to be an entrepreneur, if you want to do paid advertising for a living and you can market other companies' products, you can take my course. It's $2,000. It's a six-week course. It's intensive. There's a certification. There's support. There's coaches. There's live weekly webinars. There's a lot of stuff in it and you're learning from somebody who runs a pretty big business himself and has done this for a living. You can learn more about that. There's a link in the description that'll take you to a training that'll teach you about the course and what it's about and what you'll be learning in there. So check that out. Link is in the description. And lastly, the third major thing to get ahead of the curve is learning data analysis. So you learn data analysis. It just really ties in both data analysis and paid advertising are really two sides of the same coin. If you can do both of these, data analysis will make you more effective in paid advertising. Data analysis will actually just make you more effective in all marketing or just in life, really. So learning data analysis really helps with paid advertising. And I suggest you learn it or at least learn the basics. And I have a video, another video on this channel where you can learn the basics of data analysis. Now this next topic is very important because it's about gaining experience. No matter what you do, just being book smart is not going to help you out in life. If you read 10 books, let's say you're 13 years old, you read 10 books on how to impress women. Chances are you're not going to get out there, start talking to a girl and get a date on the first try. Okay. Reading books about how to make a woman love you is not necessarily going to help you, you know, get your first kiss or whatnot. How you learn to date is through experience. How you learn to be in a relationship involves a lot of experience. You can't just read about it. You can read every book on sales and it all goes away when you pick up the phone. So experience is the best teacher of them all. And no matter what you do, even if you're just trying to get a job, I suggest you get experience. A couple places you can get experience, Fiverr. Not only can you get experience doing marketing for businesses, but you can earn $5 doing so. Actually, sorry, I think Fiverr takes a dollar. So you earn $4, okay? It's like four. Earth. So you can earn money and gain experience at the same time. So you're gaining experience and getting paid. Another great site to gain experience on if you're looking to get into digital marketing is Upwork. I did a lot of jobs on Upwork. I call it practice, right? Uh, although I was getting paid, I was getting paid $500 a month. I was, I was making, in, from all my clients on Upwork, I was making $4,000 a month in addition to my job. I, well, eventually I became the director of marketing at the company I was working for and I was getting paid $6,000 a month. Now on Upwork, I got paid an additional $4,000 $4, a month because I was working on so many clients' accounts. So not only did I earn additional income, but you know, I was gaining experience. That was the most important thing to me. I didn't mind if I was working all day. It didn't matter to me because I wanted to spend more time gaining experience. And if you look at things through that lens, it's going to be very positive for you. And lastly, you can start with local businesses. Okay. Local businesses are in dire need of marketing. They suck at it. No offense if you're a local business owner watching this, but they suck at local, uh, suck at marketing. They're getting there just eaten out by Amazon. Jeff Bezos is just destroying local businesses. He's just walking down Main Street and just like He's like just a wizard with like fireballs just destroying Main Street. All hail Jeff though. I think he's a, like one of the smartest guys. I study him. I think he's fantastic. But a lot of local businesses, you could talk to local business and say, hey, I'll do your marketing for free and you pay me what you think it's worth if it's valuable to you. I think that'll be a great pitch. And you could say, I'll do your social media. I'll do whatever. Help out local businesses. They need it. And last but not least is network. Okay. I found it's so important to actually meet and talk with other people in marketing before you get into a job position. Now, schools won't teach this. What schools will teach you if you want to get into marketing or, you know, digital marketing or get into a job or get into a new industry or profession, they'll teach you to submit resumes. That's just like a horrible idea. That's like a way not to get hired. Okay. Talk to current or former employees of a company. If you know you want to get into digital marketing, find companies that have a lot of digital marketers, that hire a lot of digital marketers, and then look up employees in those companies. Talk with them. Ask them about how they like it. Ask them about job security. Ask them about pay. Ask them about how the bosses treat them. Ask them a billion questions. Ask them about the culture. Okay. Remember, you're looking for a job here. You're looking to work for a company. Or if you're not looking to work for a company, you're looking to be an entrepreneur. Okay. 
Talk to other people doing that line of work, you know? Ask them. Ask a social media influencer, you know? Are you happy? Do you work too much? Do you work too little? How many hours a day do you work? Almost every job requires a lot of work. You know, also reach out to the companies themselves. You don't just need to, you know, re submit your resume to companies that are asking for people to submit their resume. You'll actually have a better chance of finding jobs if you talk to companies that don't have any job listing. I never post a job listing. I'll hire somebody for something if they contact me. Point being, don't just rely on other people. Be self-reliant. Reach out. Do outreach. Outreach to employees. Outreach to companies. And also, as you're going through gaining experience and learning marketing, post your case studies on social media. Create a blog. Create a vlog. Talk about what you're doing. It'll be very powerful. And if you're looking to get a job or if you're looking to get clients or if you're just looking to do it for yourself, creating that network around you of people who are attracted to the case studies you're posting will help you a lot. Now, back about eight years ago, I started posting, or maybe it was nine, I started posting consistently on this one internet marketers forum called Stack That Money. And I would post a diary. Every day I'd post what I did in terms of trying to be an affiliate marketer. And I would post stats. I'd post like, you know, I got, you know, a thousand people saw my ad, you know, a hundred people clicked, 10 people bought, you know, I'd post whatever it was. Usually it was zero people bought. And I would post images of my ads. I'd post where I was advertising. I'd post my landing ending pages. I'd post the offer I was selling. I'd post everything so that people could hopefully give me feedback. And I posted day after day after day after day and nobody would respond. Nobody would tell me what I was doing right or wrong. But over time, as people saw that I was consistent, I, I would just journal every day, day in, day out, hoping that people might start giving me feedback or somebody might be watching how I'm trying things or my methodology. And I, people started commenting and giving me feedback on why I wasn't making any money, why I was losing money every day. I think some people just in that forum, it has about 2,000 members, some people would just see me and think it's painful that I'd been posting for 20 days without making any money, right? And they're just like, wow, this kid wants it, he's hungry, he's trying, but he sucks. And posting case studies I continued to do that for years and be involved in that forum, Stack That Money. And I actually built up a little bit of a following from Stack That Money. And if anybody here is a Stack That Money member, type in the comments below if you are a Stack That Money forum member. Actually, if you frequent any particular marketing forum, let me know which forum you are in, uh, in the comments below. Maybe it's my forum, Jet Set, or maybe it's Warrior Forum. I don't know what else there is, Wicked Fire, etc. But just by posting in a forum, just a small group of people, 2,000 people, not a big audience, but very targeted. I was able to get feedback that allowed me to actually start making money and just really just quit my job and travel the world, and become a millionaire and, you know, get married young and have kids young or younger than most other people my age and all sorts of stuff. So networking, I think, is really important and creating that audience around you. And what's great about when you're posting about advertising or marketing that you're doing or learning is that you're actually attracting those people around you. Right now, most of the people that you surround yourself with probably are concerned with, you know, maybe the next Brad Pitt movie or the next X-Men show or, you know, the next, the, the newest series on Netflix. And that's great. But slowly, if you start posting about marketing stuff, you'll start getting those people away from you, which is a good thing. You don't want consumers around you. You want producers. And producers notice other producers and they're attracted to that. So you can start surrounding yourself with the right sort of people and you can start getting help. People will give you their help, but you have to show that you're hungry, you're taking initiative, and that you're results-based. Woo! I hope this has been enlightening and let me know if you are excited about digital marketing. Type in you're excited below. And also I'd be interested in hearing, are you looking to, for information about digital marketing because you're looking for a job or are you looking for it to be an entrepreneur? Type in job or entrepreneur in the comments because I'd love to see kind of where you lie and what's the most important thing. Also, if you have any questions or if you have any topics you'd like me to address, type in what you'd like me to talk about or the questions you have down in the comments below. And for my other watchers, if you have answers to the comments below, please answer them. I get so many messages a day, I just can't handle it anymore. Now, if you're looking for more interaction with other individuals, check out my groups. We have a Discord channel, we have a Facebook group, we have a subreddit where you can interact with other marketers, learn and do things and just, you know, 
know, soak in all that knowledge. Subscribe to my channel, check out my other videos. We have a lot of cool stuff on this channel about marketing. I release videos every single day, so enable notifications and check all. And check out these amazing stories from some of my students. If you're interested in going to the next level, check out my course, Super Affiliate System, and check out these stories from some of my students about what they've been able to achieve with a Super Affiliate System. Yo, so this guy has something to say. I was able to quit my job because of this mastermind beast right here. Dude, that's fucking rad. That's fucking rad. That is awesome, dude. Congrats. Hey guys, my name is Tomomi and uh, I am part of the Jet Set program. I implemented what I learned in the program uh, a week ago and I've made several sales already. Um, I am a single mom in Tucson, Arizona and I've been struggling to pay my bills and now I have an internet business and I'm so excited. Uh, I've bought several other internet marketing programs. Nothing has made me much money at all and the Jet Set program made me money Within two days, I got my first sale. So um, everybody out there who wants to make money online, start with the Jet Set program. It is so easy to understand and you get a lot of one-on-one -on -one attention if you need it. Uh, the community is great and I totally, totally, totally recommend it. So, thank you. Thank you, John Cristani. <laughs>